This program deals with extreme weight loss and should only be attempted if you've tried everything else, are sick of lugging around excess flab, and have consulted a physician. Are your extra pounds bringing you down? My last 10 pounds are right here. I have a cheeseburger chin. My last 10 pounds are definitely in the uh, Bar Star Ballet. Jamie is a 26-year-old grad student who spent more time in the pub than hitting the books. A lot of drinking, a lot of hot wings, so the added to all of this all the way around. 10 jumping jacks right there. Jamie wants to slim down and look hot for her graduation dinner. Hands and feet, hands and feet. But to do that, this grad student will need to stay out of the bar and get into the gym. It's definitely not going to be easy. The next four weeks will be Jamie's toughest course yet. You got four weeks of pain. Let's go. Give it to me. Moment on the left, right down on the hip. Over the last year, I've been writing my master's thesis. And the student lifestyle is, you know, I study with my girlfriends at school. We go for coffee. We eat a lot of bad food, a lot of, you know, greasy food, beer. Where are those hot wings? <laughs> my thesis is on increasing cycling as a commute mode. Basically, I'm saying that too few people cycle to work, and I want to increase that. The funny thing about my thesis is that I don't own a bicycle. I haven't been on a bicycle in years. I think I've let myself get to this place with my weight. It's a little tight. Just because I've just been so stressed out with studying all the time that I just kind of make an excuse. Like, I'm too busy, like I'm too tired from like spending all the day at the library to then go and exercise. It's pretty bad because I could fit them about a year ago and now no chance. The things I love to cook are grilled cheese sandwiches with bacon, instant noodles, macaroni and cheese, chips. My biggest vice is definitely beer. I've decided now it's time to lose weight because I'm graduating from my master's program and we have a big dinner at the end of the year with all my friends and all the faculty and I just want to look super hot. I want to look ready to tackle the world now that I've graduated. I'm Tommy Europe, a pro football player turned personal trainer. And this is my partner, nutrition coach Nadine Bowman. It's time for Jamie to toast to a whole new lifestyle. To me. Starting now. Shots! <laughs> are we too late? Your shots are here. <laughs> Tommy Europe, personal trainer. Nice to meet you. Nadine Bowman, nutrition specialist. Were those the shots you were expecting? I was expecting a Jaeger bomb. There was a Tommy bomb. Jaeger bomb Monday. Jaeger bomb Monday. Yes. Well, just yeah. wait till you get to Tommy Tuesday. <laughs> Hands up. Oh. oh. <laughs> Bust. Thirty-six inches. <laughs> Finger in your belly button. Waist. Thirty-four. Oh. 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 Hips. Thirty-six. Well, let's get those shoes off and get you up on the scale. Oh, God. Wait. A hulking. <laughs> 107 pounds. <laughs> How tall are you? 4'7". How do you feel about your numbers? Terrible. You ready to work? I'm definitely ready to work. Drink your water shots. Go ahead. To Tommy and Nadine. Thank you. We'll be zeroing in on Jamie's bar star belly as we take at least 10 pounds off her in the next four weeks. Let's see what goes into this bar star belly. Cheesies full of fat. Hot chocolate, we know it's full of sugar. We do not want Jamie drinking her calories. Macaroni and cheese, noodles, processed, granola bars, or just like candy bars, and alcohol. This girl's not drinking for the next four weeks. Beer, pop, energy drinks, three major problems for Jamie. Oh, the whipped cream that she loves to put in her Irish cream coffees. This is a no-go for the next four weeks. Mayonnaise, 
We're gonna switch it up for some mustard. We're taking Jamie to the light cheese. My work is done. Hello, Jamie. Hello. You, my friend, are definitely in need of a lifestyle change. You eat like crap, you drink a lot of beer, and you're inactive. You keep that up, this is what can happen to you. <laughs> if you were to gain three pounds a year for the next 10 years, you would weigh 140 pounds. Terrible. Now, 140 doesn't sound like a lot of weight, unless you're four foot seven. Yeah, that's terrible. That's. I don't, even, I don't want to look at that. I don't want that to happen. So what are we going to do about it? Cut up the beer, the wings, and all the other bad food, and I'm going to become active. I'm glad you're ready to change. Yes. Can we stop looking at it? Jamie, we need to get you a Target outfit. Yes. You've got a master's grad party to go to. Yes. You want to impress some people. I do. First, you have to impress me. OK. Happy shopping. Thank you. You look like your worst enemy just asked you to be a bridesmaid. Tommy was pretty harsh, some pretty mean comments. You look pregnant. I don't know if Tommy's a good fashionista. He wears a lot of camo, but uh, I think he knows what looks good. I like the color, yeah. I like the style. Give me a couple turns. What size is that? Uh, small. Well, I think if we can lose some hair, <laughs> get that overhang out of the way. Yeah. Tone you up through the arms, flatten that stomach. Get rid of the muffin top. <laughs> We're gonna get extra small. Okay, an extra small. That's extra small. It's gonna take a lot of work. Tommy, it's hard enough getting on this one. Think of yourself four weeks from now. Four weeks from now. You can do it. I will do it. Put it there. The last time I got into an extra small dress was over a year ago, probably, probably two years. Ten jumping jacks right there. Hard for the sand. Get your butt down, Jamie. Hands and feet, hands and feet. I'm trying. Come on, Jamie. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Give me the last 10 pounds. 26 year old Jamie enrolled in boot camp, eager to get rid of her bar star belly. 107 pounds. Before her master's graduation party. To Tommy and Edie. <laughs> After a look at an even bigger belly in the future. Can we stop looking at it? Is this grad student ready to hit the gym as hard as she hits the books? No chance. Drill test time, Jamie. Yep. Variety of exercises, testing your strength and your cardio. I sure hope you didn't drink last night. I did. Let's go. Ah. Heel to toe choppers, Jamie. The 15 pound thing. Don't let it go behind your head. I thought I was going to drop it on my head. It was so heavy. Come up harder. Come up with power. Jamie's got a lot of fight in her. All the way She's up. pretty scrappy. She's going to need to do that over the next four weeks. 10 jumping jacks, 10 jumping jacks right there. Yeah, I'm a scrapper. I'll, I'll, I'll get Tommy by the end. Run, 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 get run, run. Get the sand. Get your butt down, Jamie. Oh, we're just getting started. Tommy. Come on, Jamie. I knew it was going to be bad, but it was awful. Strength, cardio, endurance, all of that needs work. I don't have a core. That's becoming very apparent. Hands and feet, hands and feet, hands and feet. I'm trying. She's going to have to work. She's going to have to bust her ass. Deal with it. I wanted to see how hard I can push her. I wanted to see how hard she could go. Run to the water, full speed. This is day one, and it's going to get a lot tougher. Jamie, we're going to target everything. Going to push you harder than you've been pushed before. OK. Jamie's going to have to bring her game face every day. You've passed the drill test. This is something I really want, and I'm definitely ready to commit to it. It's pretty obvious after that display that I need it. Jamie, we need to talk about your beverage consumption. For a little girl, you sure pack in the beverages. I've had a lot of practice. Well, let's talk about your morning beverage, which you love to drink on weekends. Yes. Irish cream coffee with tons of whipped cream, 200 calories and 12 grams of fat. That is just like eating one of these babies. 12 grams of fat in one of those drinks. She might as well be eating a hot dog. Afternoon drinks, cola. 97 calories, 27 grams of sugar. That's like eating 40 gummy bears. In one. In one. That's adding to the old uh, bar star belly. Let's talk about your evening drink-a-thons. Yes. Four times a week, you're drinking at least four pints. Yes. Each pint, 150 calories. That's 2,400 calories per week. That's like eating eight cheeseburgers. Eight cheeseburgers. But guess what it works out to in a month? 
9,600 calories or 32 cheeseburgers. Jamie would not eat 32 cheeseburgers, but yet she's slamming back beer like there's no tomorrow. Did you know that it takes about 30 hours of cycling to burn all of this off? No. Are you ready to commit to making a change? I'm, I'm ready to commit, absolutely. Jamie, let's talk new food. What do you think? I'm gonna be hungry. Let's talk about it in detail. Breakfast, one plum, one whole wheat English muffin, two tablespoons of the natural peanut butter, and one glass of skim or soy milk. That doesn't look like a lot or very appetizing. It's giving your body what it needs to get through the day, or at least through to your snack. Eight walnuts and half a cup of strawberries. I mean, it's no chocolate chip muffin. For lunch, one of your favorite grilled cheese sandwich. Is there any cheese in there? There is one ounce of skim Havarti cheese in there. I eat a lot more cheese. I know actually. you do, but look what happens when you eat a lot more cheese. Yes. Here we've got two cups of salad. You're gonna use the balsamic vinaigrette dressing. Afternoon snack, half a cup of snap peas, 15 almonds, and two tablespoons of low fat dressing. Dinner, spaghetti. Two cups of spinach, two thirds cup of whole wheat pasta, three ounces of lean ground beef, got mushrooms, half a can of tomato sauce, and some red peppers. It's gonna be filling, it's gonna be delicious. What more could you ask for? Hot wings. This new meal plan is gonna rock your world. No. You have this to take to school, everything's set for you. Do you think you can do it or what? That's gonna be a struggle. That's gonna be a big struggle actually, but I can do it. Hello, Jamie. You have a graduation coming up, correct? Yes, We're gonna I go do. through a bunch of exercises today. We gotta lose some inches, lose some pounds. You got a target outfit to fit into. So come on. Jump up, squat, jump back, land on one leg. I've never been good with coordination, so... Are you afraid of heights? Jumping on the BOSU with one leg was definitely a challenge. No, land on two. Land on two. Jamie's fitness plan is gonna be full of full body exercises. You're working your legs, you're working your core. She's pretty much built like a brick right now. So these walkouts, obviously they're working your arms, they're working your core. Jamie has a tough time with compound exercises, working multiple muscle groups at the same time. Up, touch, come back. But that's exactly what we're gonna do for the next four weeks. Good. She has to stick with the program, the ball. follow her meal plan, Good. and then she has a fighting chance. Exercises like this, you're gonna be doing a lot of them. Really wanna target through your midsection, burn as many calories as possible, as fast as possible. Good luck. Thank you. If I don't do it now, I'm just gonna get older and slower and fatter. Butt kick time, and you know why. Why? Give me the last 10 pounds. Uh, pretty nervous. I don't want to disappoint Tommy, but uh, I don't know if I've lost any inches or any weight. Hello, Jamie. Hi. Ready for your two-week win? I guess so. Then let's do it. Stand right here. Hands up. Bust. 33 inches. Down three inches. Nice one. Yay. Can you your belly button? Waist. 30. Down four inches. No. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. That's the excited look, right? I, this is very excited. I can see that. Feet together. Okay. Hips. 35. Down one inch. That means you've lost eight inches in total. Nice work, Jamie. Yay! Oh, I don't even know what to say. I'm so excited. Hard work pays off, doesn't it? Yes, it does. It does. Let's get you up on the scale. Okay. At the two week point, your weight 100 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> you've lost seven pounds. Yay! Seven pounds, eight inches, two weeks. I'm so excited. Only halfway. We still got a lot of work to do, so no slacking off. None. Let's get you in that dress. Sounds good. It's huge, I had no idea. Especially the waist, four inches. I'm really surprised, but I'm so excited. Okay. Give us a little bit of a turn. We're very loose back here. So Jamie, it looks like you're going double X, dress small. Go get changed. Not drinking. I think that's the biggest thing. It's tough just talking about it, but next two weeks, none of that. Jamie, butt kick time. 
and you know why. Why? Can you explain this? Okay, maybe I had a little slip up. She can't afford to cheat at all. Welcome to Tommy's Pub. The fact that she drank some beer, I had to make her pay. Time to tap the keg, holding on with both hands. Having to hold all this beer and not being able to drink it? It was mean. It was just one beer. Just one beer? Just one and a half. Can't afford it. She was doing great at the two-week weigh-in, and then she slipped up. Unfortunately, we're short on staff, so you're going to have to work for me. Come on. I'm not mad at Tommy. I cheated. we got to run some beer, Jamie. So we got step-ups. Table three. It's a beer theme, so I made her do uh, beer taps. I made her do the step-ups with the press-up. Step off. It was really hard. They were really heavy. For a normal person, it wouldn't be so bad. At four foot seven, that's quite the feat. Oh, we've got another order, table six. There you go. For the next few weeks, it's going to be tough on Jamie. She's got to hang in there. Going to throw a lot of different things at her, lots of core work. We just got robbed. Go catch him. Run. Full speed. Go. Faster. Knees up. Knees up, Jamie. Come on. I don't think I'd be at the dorm in Pure Path. Well, since uh, Tommy said that I had to fit into a double extra small, it's pretty important. My boys told me they're out of beer. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it, especially if I cheat and drink beer. We got a pub crawl down the stairs and up. Jamie does work extremely hard, and I expect after today, she's going to work even harder. How many beers did you have? One. All the way back down. Uh, Come on, Jamie. My patrons are thirsty. No, I don't think I'll cheat again. Back down. Come on. I can't. Be strong. Going back to beer is just the bad cycle, and I need to stay away from it. No more beer? No more beer, I promise. It's not so easy to carry a six pack around, is it? No, it's not. Think of that next time you want to drink one. Give me the last 10 pounds. Jamie is a 26-year-old grad student hoping to master her bad eating habits and slim down before her graduation dinner. She had great results at the two-week weigh-in. You've lost seven pounds. But fell off the wagon at her favorite pub a few days later. I gave her a butt kick at Tommy's Bar to get her back on track. Just one beer? Just one and a half. Welcome to your final challenge. Today will be a biathlon. We had a bike followed by a run. 10K overall, one last time. <laughs> You're gonna be carrying your beer. Come on, turn around. There's your six pack. Oh. Ready? I guess. Yeah, I definitely think having the six pack of beer was just like, you know, where I was four weeks ago with more of the bar star belly. Come on, Jamie, let's go. Six pack strapped to her back. Wanted to give her that feeling of what she was carrying around before, and it didn't have to be that way. I'm paddling. Uh, we had some hills, and those were a little bit of an issue for Jamie. The little one struggling. It was a bit tough at first, just because I have not been on a bicycle since I was pretty young. Come on, Jamie! The bridge was uh, was challenging at the beginning. Uh, I think she liked the uh, the last half of the bridge better because it was all downhill. All right, round two. Now you are running. Giddy up. The running was tougher because of the extra weight of the six pack, you know, bouncing along with me. So, yeah, it was not a great feeling. You brought it on yourself. Jamie's a competitor. <laughs> Think of that next time you want to drink one. She's worked hard through every single thing I, I put her through in boot camp. Keep that bitter beer face going. <sighs> We're almost there, Jamie. Come on. Get those legs going. You're doing great. You're coming all the way to me. Come all the way to me. I'm looking forward to the final way, and you know I did really well at the uh, midpoint, so I'm a little, I'm a little nervous. Congratulations. Thank you. You've completed your final challenge. Yeah, I want to see Ugh. Could you have done this run four weeks ago? This bike and run? No, definitely not. Happy for you. You rock. Thank you. I'm excited about the final way in. I want to see how she does. We don't need that. I'll see you at the final way in. Sounds good. Hello, Jamie. Hi. You shrunk. I hope so. We're about to find out. Stand right here. Hands up. Bust. 32 inches. You've lost four inches. Nice. Jamie, nice work. <laughs> Finger in your belly button. Waist. 30. Down four inches off your waist. Eight inches. Feet together. Hips. 33. Nice. You're down three inches. So if 
that's 11 inches in total you've lost. Nice Excellent. work. Thank you. Now let's get you up on the scale. Okay. Weight, 96 pounds. Excellent. You've lost 11 pounds. That's awesome. Excellent. Thank you. 11 pounds, 11 inches. Perfect. Let's get you in that Target outfit. Sounds good. I feel fantastic that I lost 11 pounds. I wasn't sure if I was gonna hit the 10, so I'm really excited that I lost 11. Wow. Looking good, Jamie. Thank you. Give me a couple slow turns. All right. Show it off, because <laughs> it looks fantastic. You've got shape. <laughs> 11 inches made a huge difference. It did. You've got the dress, you've got the body. Kick ass at that grad event. Thank you. Yeah. Come here. Thank you. Congratulations. Jamie lost 11 pounds and 11 inches and looks great in her little blue dress. She successfully defended her thesis and excelled at boot camp as well. Now she's ready to wow everyone at the party and start a whole new life as a graduate. The grad party is going to be great. I get to go show off how hard I've worked with my new uh, slim down body. So I'm excited to get this dress, get all ready, and go wow everyone. You look awesome. Let's go knock them dead. Yeah.